hello and welcome back to our channel all things with us i hope you'll be doing well yeah welcome back if you're already a subscriber thank you for always supporting us and if you're new here feel much welcome in this channel so we are very glad that you have joined us uh, in this video it's all about part two of the part one video where we did a diy floating tv stand if you haven't watched the part one kindly go and watch it so that you will understand this part two of this video because i'm going just to start where i left off from the part one whereby i'm going to do the final touches on this tv stand then i'm going to do the delivery and mount it in my client's home so i hope you will enjoy this video and give it a like comment down below tell me what you think and if you have other ideas or something you need us to try kindly comment down below anyway if you really like this kind of content where we do this kind of diy's transformation videos and many more yeah if you visit our channel you will notice that we do a lot of things we try a lot of things that's why we are called all things with us so if you like this kind of content like ours kindly subscribe to our channel hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever we upload new videos like our videos comment tell us what you think about our content we will really really appreciate your support so without further ado let us go to the video let us see what is going on so here as you can see i'm just going to do the final touches where I'm going to I'm going to put the handles on the doors. Also in this video I'm going to show you the kind of lighting I'm going to do where my customer or my client requested me to put blue lights and that is what I'm going to put and I'm going to use a uh, hot glue gun to stick my lights and then i'm going to use an adapter which is 12 volts 12 volts because of the lights that i'm going to use So now here is the next day whereby I'm going to do the delivery for the TV stand and I just thought that I take this, I show you this little clip here and give you a time or a moment or a minute to take your time and subscribe to our channel, like this video, comment down below, tell me what you think 
as I do my delivery. Yeah, that is the stand I'm going to deliver. So let us meet at my client's home. So guys, as you can see, this is the place that I'm going to work on. This is the part that I'm going to mount the TV stand, the floating TV stand. And this is also the part that I'm going to, de to transform. Unfortunately, I didn't record myself drilling the walls. But already I did the drilling. And I've already inserted the small plastic. They are called wall plugs that are being used to mount things on the wall. They help when you screwing screws in the wall so that it will attach very firmly. So I've already drilled and inserted the plastic plugs on the wall. So now I'm going to use this plastic basin and a cushion, my client cushion, <laughs> to to use it as support as I mount my as I as I mount this TV stand. So also I'm going to use a a, a spirit leveler to level the TV stand so that it will be leveled and then mount it in the wall. So just watch the video and you will understand what I'm doing. So I'm going to use this small plastic, this piece of plastic, it is called trunking to hide the wires. As you have seen the picture that uh, I show you, the before picture, there were a lot of wires roaming around. So I'm going to use this trunking to hide these wires and bring out a network. After I'm done with everything, I'm just going to screw back the doors and do a little organization here before I give you the final reveal. And I hope you have enjoyed this video till this far and I hope that you have already subscribed and liked this video. So now let us wait for the final reveal and tell me on the comment section below what you thought of this video. Thank you.